Uh, moving on to a football now. There's one major match that's happening here in South Africa this coming weekend. Zamalek will be facing off with Orlando Pirates in a CAF Confederations Cup Group B clash at Mbombelo Stadium in Nelspruit tomorrow. The Egyptian Giants will be without many key players such as Omar Gaber, Mahmoud Ganesh, Ahmed Biwidar, Hassem Imam, Ahmed Ali and Yusuf Obama who all have injuries. In this year's edition of the Confederations Cup, Zamalek have lost only once. They've played seven games to date, five wins, one draw and one loss. During the same period, they've scored an impressive 13 goals and only conceded five times. We're now joined by two fans of the team, Mohamed Zaki and Mohamed Zakaria. Good morning and Good welcome morning. to Morning Live. Good morning. Great to have you guys in here. I'm going to start with you, Zaki, okay, because you've laid out this beautiful flag. And I know any team coming from Egypt, yes. there is very big support for their teams. Exactly. Tell me a little bit about Zamalek. If you talk about Zamalek, you talk about 107 years ago. Very old and start football in whole Africa. This team, you start before... Uh, many and many and many years with young people, more about uh, 200 uh, caps in whole Africa, more about uh, 42 million people to like Zamalek in whole Africa, not only in Egypt. From 28 Arab countries to love Zamalek, to love this name, to love this flag. I'm happy in the Zamalek, second time you come to South Africa, and the every time. From seven, you come six a time, you go back with cap from South Africa. And South Africa, very nice, and you, and, and, and you play here again with, 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 with beautiful brother and sister in all Africa. Okay, so you've got a team that's steeped in history, one that uh, says they were the very first to play football here in, on the continent. But, I mean... You've got another team in South Africa, in Orlando Pirates, that the support is just as big. What are you as fans expecting to see from Orlando Pirates tomorrow? To be honest, I expect uh, Orlando to make a good, good match. That's, uh, we know Orlando Pirates is a very strong team. Okay, I know this year they're not like last team and last year and all of that, but at the end of the day, it's a big match today. Uh, tomorrow is going to be. And Zamalek also is a strong team, but uh, I think Orlando Pirates also is not easy team. You know what I mean? So I think it's going to be a very good match. No, but I think in Zamalek you win 3 1. <laughs> uh, okay, so your best is that your team are going. Yeah, I mean, you have to say that. Yes. Because no, you're a national team. I see what happened in the last seven weeks between this game and this game. Zamalek in, in number one in this year in Egypt. Between 47 games, Zamalek number one, and six points up for Man Ahli. Okay, but I mentioned all the injuries uh, to the team and the fact that you guys are going to be without a number of players. You're both nodding your head. Will you be able to overcome Orlando Pirates with all of those injuries? I think Zamalek going to play like defense the whole game. You know what I mean? Zone defense the whole game. And then if any chance they can score, that's what they're going to try to do. But uh, the chance for Pirates is more because, you know, home advantage and all of this. So I think it's going to be a very hard game for Zamalek, but also not easy for Pirates. So I, I tell you a secret. My son is an Ahli. <laughs> you like an Ahli. I'm liking Zamalek. <laughs> <laughs> but it's in democracy in Egypt. <laughs> yes. Well... Well, well, they're both from the capital, so yes, I will, exactly. we, we give that to you guys. So <laughs> yes. we've got a Zamalek fan and an Al Ahli fan, and globally, these are two Egyptian teams that are very well known. But what's yeah. happening in football in Egypt? Many of the games have had to be played behind exactly. closed doors. We've had the league being suspended there. It's only really just started getting going a couple of a couple of months ago. I mean, as fans, it's other fans that are causing these problems for the game. What happened in Egypt in, uh, after 2011? In everything confused, like, uh, like a strong bone in new baby in Egypt. No one you know where democracy, and people confused. And what happened in uh, Zamalek before five, six months? 
I don't know, maybe, maybe in not, not system for police, uh, uh, some people play in ticket, you make in, sorry, in fake ticket, but in, it's heaven. You lose uh, more about 22 people die in seven minutes. The problem mm. in Egypt now is security. Security is they can't even secure the, the, the fence. Let's be honest, because what happened with politics and all of this is affecting the football there in Egypt. That's why there's no supporters anymore. You see now the, the, the Malik Al Ahli, they play now, there's no supporters at all, you know, it, which is hard for any team to play with no supporters, you know. So I think, I think it's going to be better in the coming year or something. We're trying, we're trying. Everything come right in Egypt. Yeah. I think a new time to come every night. Nice. Just take time. Yes. Yeah. Just so, so once, once, so the idea is once the political situation yes. uh, is more calm, then you'll see that being restored also yes. uh, and evidence when it comes to what's happening at the football matches. Yes, exactly. exactly. Yes. All right, great. Two Zamalek fans. Well. Thank Half as I'm a leg <laughs> fan on this side because this uh, this gentleman also likes uh, Al Ahly. Pirates is my favorite team, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. So, so now you're a little bit torn. Who are you going to be supporting tomorrow? I'm going to be support. You know, I'm not losing anyway. If Zamalek <laughs> win, I'm also winning. If Pirates win, I'm also winning. But I am with Zamalek from <laughs> one in ten. <laughs> and thank you so much. <laughs> thank you guys very thank much for so coming much. in. Uh, we wish you, your team, all the best of luck tomorrow. But of course, thank we'll you. be watching closely as uh, the whole of South Africa get behind the South African participants in the CAF Confederations Cup, which of course is Orlando Pirates. That match taking place at Mbombela Stadium tomorrow is part of the CAF Confederations Cup. It's